Good morning, everybody out there to our next webinar about JFT Invest. My name is Stefan Friedrichowski. A warm welcome in my name and, of course, in the name of JFT as well. Yeah, this time this webinar is already really early in the morning. I forgot um, when I set up the webinar <laughs> that we have um, the end of summertime. But anyhow, okay, it's 9 o'clock Monday morning, so really uh, quite early. JFT Invest. That is really an interesting story. And uh, normally it's called here JFT Invest Trading and Investing Simplified Highlights of the Week. And uh, yeah, the highlights are still in preparation or right now in preparation. But the good thing is I know already the highlights. So the newsletter will be sent out uh, later the day. And um, of course, um, this time it will be FX Global will be the top performer of the week. Um, and yeah, what we will do here today is that we have a look to JFT invest at all and to our portfolio you know that we have um, one uh, portfolio here um, my personal one and I follow a couple of strategy and uh, yeah let's let's look whether we are right balanced invested and um, whether we have to change something or yeah and let's have a look on the outperform of last week uh, this is a fix global I think it's followed by goldmine so uh, yeah let's look for both of them but before really starting here um, a for short view on uh, our risk disclaimer so I talk about trading here talk about investment possibilities but whatever you do finally you do it by your own and on your own responsibility I think that's self-explaining but uh, yeah anyhow it has to be uh, mentioned at least once here good so JFT Invest, uh, let's have a, uh, let's start on the web page of uh, JFT, and uh, if you would like to get more informa information about JFT Invest, it's uh, below Investing JFT Invest, and then we can uh, start looking around what to do. Let's first start with the overall top performing strategies. So what you see here. It's a list of strategies which is pre-selected by JFD. Those are the top five performers, and we have returns between 10 and um, yeah, above 40% here. So they are really high-performance trading strategies. And the good thing is that all of those you can follow just with a few mouse clicks. Those are the top performers, and you see already some more details here on the web page, um, like uh, last month's year-to-date equity balance deviation. Uh, that's a key figure we will talk in a minute a little bit more in, in detail about. Um, but you see, we have really high performance strategies here on board, and there are even more and also those um, we will discuss in a minute. But now you see those results. But how can you participate uh, on those strategies? So it's really quite easy. Um, you have, in total, you have to go through four steps. So first thing is you have to sign up in the JFD Invest profile. That is nothing more than just to register uh, with your email address, a password, and then, then you have full access to the strategies. You can see even more details than just as a guest. And um, so you can see close trades of all the strategies um, and you can investigate uh, a little bit more in depth um, what kind of strategies you like uh, most and you do your own selection for um, those strategies you might want to follow. Next step is you have to open an um, JFD Invest account, and that's a special account. It's not your regular JFD account. You can't even use your regular JFD account because there are two, two things you have to keep in mind. One is that you are not able to really trade by your own. So you cannot open a long trade on Euro, Euro US dollar by your own, and you cannot um, manipulate stop losses and take profits of ongoing trades. That's the one thing. So um, it's a so-called read-only account. And the other thing is that kind of account is a so 
called professional account, which has a leverage of 1 to 100, because all those strategies you might want to follow are strategies from professional traders, and that means you can participate even on the leverage uh, of those uh, professional traders. Finally, you connect your profile with a JFD Invest um, account, or vice versa, and you start selecting and mirroring trades into your uh, personal JFD Invest account. The good thing is that everything is done personalized. So you are the portfolio manager. You set up the rules, which strategy, which amount of risk, which amount of money you allocate for a specific strategy. And that's a real cool thing because you act as a portfolio manager. But now let's have a look. So let's start with, um, which is called just a guest access. And uh, even with the guest access, you see now that there are even more strategies than on the web page. Uh, right now we have uh, eight strategies here in total. And uh, you see all those strategies are uh, positive. And uh, we have strategies with a return a few percent and up to more than 40%. Always you see the so-called inception date, means starting uh, the start date of that specific strategy, that specific account. And you see the overall return, the last month with month's result, the year to date, and finally the key figure, uh, equity balance deviation. Um, unfortunately, I know that if I go for uh, FX Global, there is right now maintenance of um, that calculation, that kind of statistics. Therefore, uh, we have no numbers right now here. But anyhow, it's a great strategy. You will see later the day when you, uh, you have full access once again that all the months are positive. So seven months in a row are positive it's really a great strategy and up to now we have our, um, six investors on that account and we have more than 25,000 um, euros under management for that specific strategy so then let's go for the second one which will be um, the second best uh, of the week as well so <laughs> in this case we have the same um, um, row here uh, of uh, overall performance and uh, weekly performance. Uh, in this case, it's the same. So, since we have more numbers on gold mine available, let's have a look here and let's see what kind of numbers we present as key figures for those strategies. There are two things one is the numbers itself, and the other thing is that I always tell you that even copying. A strategy mirroring those trades into your personal account is still similar to your own trading activities. That means those strategies should fit to your personal preferences. You might, okay, everybody has a preference of uh, high profit. Okay, uh, that's understood. But there are more things to be taken into account, like um, what kind of volatility is that strategy offering? Um, so how many ups and downs uh, within the equity do you have? Or what is the, the, the um, uh, deviation, the standard deviation of the daily returns? If those numbers are maybe too high, then it that strategy does not fit to you. And finally, you will not like the strategy because, um, yeah, it's not the one uh, which is on your preference list. Let's quickly go through because we have here growth. We have seen already that strategy has more than 20%. Next, what we always offer is um, both lines, the equity and the balance. Both lines are important because um, the balance is always telling you, yeah, what is the, the, the amount of money on your uh, account and equity includes all open trades, which might have floating losses or floating profits. So um, in this case, for example, if I go here, you see that the balance is above equity, which means, okay, there have been floating losses for those uh, for that strategy. Overall, it's a great strategy going uh, here from the right um, left corner as a low 
low end right corner to the high and left corner it's a great strategy 20 percent up to now and let's have a look to the returns as well so that is important to see because it's showing you a little bit of the volatility of that strategy um, you see we have daily returns um, a few percent to the uh, positive few percent negative but not that high so it's quite good balanced uh, about the returns so you have not to accept or to um, to, to expect uh, that much volatility finally uh, when it comes to your mirrored and copied trade into your, your personal jfd invest account um, the last might be of interest as well which is the equity balance deviation that means how many percentage difference do we have between uh, the balance which is the real money on your account and the equity is including floating profits and losses and here you see okay up to maybe three four percent we have deviations that means there have been floating losses finally we covered and um, turned into profits but of course we have to take that into account when it comes to your selection of uh, strategies there are much more key figures um, i always like to have a look on the monthly return table as well for example this strategy is now on board since nearly one year so uh, in two days uh, so will hit the one year um, and let's have a look to how many minus and um, positive uh, months we have okay there has been one in august with negative numbers october up to now is <laughs> slightly minus even zero but there's a minus sign hopefully that turns to a green number as well but you see overall a steady growth the other thing i uh, have um, always look for is um, that I go for what kind of instruments are traded uh, even that might be fit to your uh, personal preferences or not in this case we have a couple of forex pairs here um, I think it's uh, 13 forex pairs uh, no indices and um, the forex pairs traded are let's call them the regular one not only major uh, more even more minor forex pairs than major one major we have um here one uh, us dollar japanese yen you might call us dollar canadian dollar um, a major as well um, or even uh, new zealand dollar us dollar but you see overall we have really lots of trades in total it's more than 1000 trades in the history so it's real good statistics um which means it's not a strategy like um, yeah it has been picked by uh, just by selection purposes only looking oh god uh, there have been 10 good trades we present that strategy no there's statistics really behind um, that strategy but now i mentioned okay those uh, two here are the best of last week gold mine and fx global so let's have a look how to follow and maybe we follow those strategies already in our um, JFD invest account so therefore I switch so I log out as a guest and I switch with my personal one um, and uh, that is now the JFD invest profile which is already linked as you remember my four steps um, it's already linked to my jfd invest account also therefore we have an account number here and I always when you log in to your jfd invest profile you see already the balance of your jfd invest account hmm. okay we started a little bit more than one month ago uh, here at the 23rd of uh, september there was a 10,000 euro account yeah good thing is we reached already 10,700 so we earned within month, one month already seven percent which is a really really good thing uh, for one uh, month's account or one month's uh, time duration but the other good thing is we can have a look more in depth as well so let's look to the view um, um, performance analysis and then it looks like that we look to a strategy 
that's really a brilliant uh, thing at JFD that, that you can even investigate your, your personal JFD Invest account as a strategy. So what you see here is a growth as well. And you see, okay, um, even um, life uh, changes in equity. So you see the numbers here are changing as I speak. So total balance is 10,700. Um, right now we have about 30 euros losses, floating losses uh, as we speak. And those uh, numbers are changing. Um, you see the um, personal monthly return table, uh, traded instruments, and which is really good as well. You see all the open trades right now. So you see we have a lot of trades open from gold mine um, and uh, trading in this case gold. Uh, those trades are open, and you see. Um, the floating uh, profit and losses, but there are um, other trades open and everything is available as your information here. I mentioned I want to review a little bit about my allocations. So I click on allocations. Um, that means I can see those strategies which I follow. And in this case, you see that I have six active allocations and you see the amount of money which is allocated which is linked to those that strategy and you see that i have numbers from three thousand down to one thousand the three thousand has been the minimum um account size for fx global performance so uh, all the others have uh, lower numbers for as minimum account size but in this case the three thousand is the minimum therefore i there was no choice to go a uh, little bit uh, with a smaller um, amount of money for that strategy. Therefore, I decided, okay, I go with the three. Um, and of course, what we can see is that in total, we have invested 9,000 euros. Um, so we, we could reallocate or we might uh, want to reallocate some money. How would we do it? Because you see, um, I don't have in mind to change anything. Therefore, I, I'm using <laughs> um, the phrase would. Yeah, the first would be that we have to stop. Uh, any activity stopping is here at the right um, that we just stop uh, a specific strategy and we then do the selection process once again and say maybe we want to change um, to maybe 2000 or 3000 uh, whatever number which is still possible so um, to go from a one to a 2000 here would be too, too much because uh, that would exceed my my, my overall um, account but um, that's how we could do it so we follow those five strategies fx global balance power fx gold mine and bip generator okay let's uh, let's have that in mind uh, what we uh, and oh there's a sixth one uh, and euro dream so i think yeah that's a good selection and have those in mind uh, still we go back to find strategies and uh, let's see, okay, um, there are a few more available. We are trading six of them. And what we are actually doing um, in, in, in my account is we trade all the uh, best uh, six here. Hmm, okay, maybe we should go for um, Vulcano as well. That might be something we have in mind that we, um, invest into Vulcano as, as well. And um, I think, yeah, why not? Let's do it. Uh, let's go for that strategy as well. And you see uh, how easy it is. We, what we, we have to do is we just press the button follow and um, then we uh, have to answer some questions uh, for, for that strategy, how much money we want to investigate, uh, invest to invest into that strategy. And I think I will go for 1,000. And I want to apply the risk management, which means uh, that whenever that strategy is losing, in my case, more than 50%, I will automatically stop out of that strategy. All the trades are closed. So there's risk protection, which is really good because there might be times that you are not, uh, you might be on holiday and have no access to the internet and you just want to leave it as it is. And then still everything works 
and is well protected automatically. You don't need anymore here an active MT4 running maybe on a VPS or wherever. So everything is managed directly at JFD. Therefore, you don't need any um, additional technical uh, stuff like um, uh, VPS uh, servers, uh, something like that. No, everything runs by its own directly at the JFD. And that's really good. So we, you see the, the um, terms here, uh, in minimum investment would be 500 U. Of course, we have a performance fee, which is high watermark, which is always the quite fair solution because only if the strategy is earning money i have to pay fees so that's good um yeah so i want to have that into my profile as well and uh, then everything is done okay that was already all the steps to have an additional strategy running in our profile in our JFD Invest account. So we have now seven strategies running um, within that um, account. And yeah, let's see for the for the next new strategies. Um, in this case, we might have to stop uh, at least one strategy if we want to switch to another one. But you see what we are doing? What we are doing here is we are acting as a portfolio manager. We have a selection of strategies here on board that those are already pre-selected. But finally, what we are doing is we decide which strategy we like most and those strategies we follow. So in this case, we follow already seven strategies. Uh, next time it will, uh, yeah, it will be time to, uh, I get the confirmation that uh, the strategy is now on board as well so that always takes a minute and then yeah we have seven strategies in that account let's see what we achieve within one week for over our portfolio and then it's um, time or maybe time to make some amendments but let's see it looks quite well we have already earned within one month seven percent so 700 euros um additionally for for that account which is a really great story okay let's see next highlights for the week and um, what we can do and what we might amend next week have a good start in the week bye-bye thanks bye-bye